In this episode of The Big Vision Show, I'm gonna share with you why I've been lying to you. Hi there, my name's Max Simon, and welcome to The Big Vision Show. This is all about how you can reach more people and thrive financially. Now, for the last few years, I've been lying to you. I've been saying that the reason for our success here has because we've built such an amazing team and we've figured out some really core strategies and we've had really good mentors. But the truth is, there's one person that I've never shared with you that's been behind the scenes here really helping us out and moving us forward. So without further ado, let me introduce you to the real reason why Big Vision Business has been so successful. I step aside. Hey everybody, I'm Einstein, and I'm so grateful to be here today on the Big Vision Show. Here's my first tip for you. Get more excited about your life and business. Here's the thing. You guys are not nearly excited enough about your business. You're going about things day to day without any passion. But that's not what people respond to. Nope, nope. They need to feel your energy. They need to see you being excited. And if you don't step up your game, you'll be spending most of your time in the doghouse. Take my word for it, you do not want to be there for too long. Not fun at all. Tip number two, you gotta be okay pissing some people off sometimes. Look, sometimes the cats get too close and I've gotta tell them, step back, give me my space. Now they don't like that, but that doesn't stop me from speaking my truth. And the problem is, too many of you are just being nice. You're so worried about what others think of you that you're not speaking up. You're not being bold. It's time to cut that out. I mean, unless you're comfortable with cats walking all over you, it's time to unleash your super bark. <coughs> Tip number three, you have to take some time away to have some fun. You work and work and work. I mean, geez, always working. What about the other parts of your life? Are you having fun? Are you taking some time to chase balls, to pee on flowers? You might not see it this way, but when you take time away from your work, you get energized. Ooh, ooh. You get all sorts of new ideas. I mean, how do you think I came up with the idea to do this video? It was while I was playing in the yard. I was rocking out. Ooh. Tip number four, you need more rest. On that note of working too hard, here is the other thing. All you entrepreneurs out there are strung out. You're overworking yourself, and that's not good for your business either. Nope, nope, nope. You need to take some time to just chill, to rest, even meditate a little. When you're out of balance, you can't bring your A game. And if you want to get the prize, you've got to show up with all your puppy power. Tip number five, be more generous with your love and support. Some of you guys are really stingy with your love. You're really holding back. And guess what? Your customers feel it too. You see, one of the reasons why I'm so popular, it's because I don't hold back at all. When I meet you, bam, I'm right in there, going for the love. I have even lick you in your face right when I meet you because I don't want to hold back. And if you want to be more well-loved and respected out in the world, you've got to start going for it today. No holding back. Remember, more face licking, that's the secret sauce. Tip number five, sometimes you need to ask for help. Look, you see these? Over here, I don't have thumbs. That makes it pretty darn hard to do things like open doors or dog food jars. So what do I do? I don't sit around telling myself a story about how sad and pathetic I am. I just go and ask for help. I make it happen with the support of the people around me. Is that what you do? I mean, I keep meeting entrepreneurs who are so stuck in their story of, I have to do it all by myself. That's cat crap. If I did that, I'd have to pee on the floor and eat smelly cat food. Phew. And I'm not cool with that. Hell nope. So give up the do it by yourself thing and start reaching out for more support. 
you might be surprised with how much more fun it really is. Okay, so that's it for me today. I hope you liked the show. I love for you to share your comments below. Max tells me that I'm a star, but I love the positive reinforcement. Heck, if you really like my point of view, maybe I'll even host future episodes. Oh yeah, oh yeah, but you've got to convince Max. Sometimes he's kind of stubborn. So, make sure to go ahead and do it right down below. Plus, it would be cool if you shared this with all of your friends. Maybe a little doggy ass whooping would be good for them too. Okay, bye everybody. See you later.